hi guys welcome back to the channel so today's video is about um the girl chris from chris and queen cheated on with her name is helena so it's about her um explaining the reason why she fell for chris because apparently everybody on the internet is attacking her for why would she be so dumb to fall for a guy she just met at the club so she wanted to clear the air and explain why she fell for him so we're gonna be watching this video together and we telling you guys what you know i would do if i was in, th in this situation and once again you already know on this channel we don't, we don't pick side so i don't want to pick any side yet i may eventually because it's getting more and more interesting from queen's side from chris side and from the girl in, in you know that was involved in this situation but first if it's your first time stopping by the channel don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below and definitely follow me on snapchat because i post a lot of juicy stuff on my snapchat like you guys already know my conversations that i'll be having with these let me not just tell you guys just follow me on snapchat because just follow me on snapchat okay and also follow me on my instagram and definitely make sure you also follow me on twitter and if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also comment down below any type of, you know, topic you guys would like me to talk about or react to and I'll sure do it. Um, first, let's jump into the video. I'll be looking at my phone because I got the video in my phone. So, yeah, let's get right, you know, let's get started. And sorry if you guys hear something moving around. My dog is like playing next to my chair, the chair which I'm filming on. And yeah, everybody on my Snapchat wanted me to, you know, do another part of the story between Chris cheating on Quinn. So before I before I really come across a big conclusion, I needed to hear from Quinn, which you know I, I did from because obviously you guys can already tell she's not okay with what's going on. The way she's you know pushing herself away from social media at the time. So that's her response. Um, I, we heard from the apology video from Chris that you guys want me to react to but I, I'm thinking I'm not sure if I will because I feel like that's just BS he keeps apologizing after he messes up but then again like I said I can't judge him you know who am I not God so um, and also from the girl that we're about to um, react to right now let's get right into the video I'm gonna be squinting on the side so you guys can see everything that's going on on here and yeah Hey guys, so I know exactly why you're here. You guys are demanding more answers. So the reason why in the video, the Christian on Clean With Me video, the reason why it was posted on Jada's channel is because basically I was never going to uh, expose him because I actually caught feelings for Chris. And it doesn't really explain why I caught feelings for him um, in the video. It just basically exposed him, talked about the club, and talked about the main, the main reasons why he was getting exposed as a cheater. But I never really explained why I caught feelings for him. So it all started off, after we met up from the club, it was just like on a friend type thing. We were just talking, we were like good friends in the beginning. Um, he was telling us about everything, about how YouTube works. And he said he would manage us and he was saying that he was going to give us a contract and get us cameras and all That's this BS. stuff. It was on new to me. Um, everything that he was telling me was really like shopping um he was explaining how he has a channel with his bm which Baby mama really, like confusing to me he did mention that he had a son he showed me pictures at least he didn't lie about it my son his name is chris and he was just telling me how he was going to make a new channel and he was going to start doing his own thing with his son and they already have a channel together so cut off um, his BM. That's what he told me. He never told me that he was married. Uh, there was never a ring on his finger. Nowadays, like, married men don't be liking to wear rings. That's why I'm like, how was I supposed to know that? I'm gonna be. If my man don't wear the ring, um, I'm sorry, but I feel like he'll be. Know, you know, I'll actually accuse him for doing stuff. I don't know if it's anyway, just me. So 
Let me just be quiet. Something that wasn't mentioned in the <clears throat> video, the first video that was on Jayla's channel, was that we went like we went on a date. We went to Denny's on Saturday night. Um, so the night after the club, we went to Denny's, and we talked about life, and you know we were like getting to know each other. He was asking me questions. I was asking him questions. Um, he told me that, you know, like he really liked me and um, like distance really isn't a problem. And, um, you know, like I'm sitting there across from him. Like everything that he was telling me was very like genuine and nice. And I totally forgot about everything that happened at the club because, you know, like, he told me that he chose me, like, he was like, you know what, like, I actually really like you, um, and he never tried to get at Jada after the fact. So, we sat there at Denny's, we didn't even eat our food, we were just talking, like, we were just vibing with each other, like, getting to Vibing with other. someone else's man. And it was really, like, um, after that, I went home, and then he was just like, have a good night, you know, he was really sweet to me, he was really, really sweet to me, and then, uh, he said he wanted to see me again, and then that's when, uh, the other thing happened, um, on the next day when I went to the movies with him, um, so the next day, we went to go see a movie, um, First, uh, he he was switching hotels, so I went with him, and then we went to go walk on like the Hollywood Street where you could see all the stars and stuff. And then we went to the movies, and we went to go see it. And like we we're chilling, like you know, like it was a it was a cool time, like. new information like, just us and like life and what he does and how he's going to branch out and you know like how our relationship is going to work out and stuff like that so i still thought that he was a good guy up until he posted a video like multiple videos the next day with Queen and that's where I was really confused so I really I watched the videos it was really hard for me to watch the videos because I was like shit he's like a cheater he's married he's a cheater so that's when Jaden and Maya convinced me to make the video with them and I didn't really think that it was going to blow up. I didn't think that a lot of people were going to actually want to see it. Um, you know, like, the only reason why I wanted to do the video is because I, I would want to know if somebody was cheating on me. I would want to know. And the fact that Queen is, like, 
you know, like her whole, like, her whole career is based on this YouTube. Technically. Do you really think she would stop doing the videos? Do you really think she would stop doing the videos? Because I told her on one on one that he cheated on her with me. Do you really think she would care? She has a point. Do you really think she would care? Do you think she would believe it? That's the part. So. Um, two, I really hope that there's not a lot of girls that have gone through this. I don't know how many girls that Chris has been messing with. I honestly don't know. Like, now that I'm thinking about it, there has to be multiple. For sure. Um, you know, like, you can always <clears throat> reach out to me. I can relate with you. We can relate with each other. We're all in this together. Like, I really hope that Queen, like, is okay. And, you know, like, life goes on. You know, people make mistakes. People, nobody's perfect. But that doesn't mean that you should stick with someone that's going to do that to you continuously and just keep apologizing for it. That's very toxic, and I've been in a relationship where I was cheated on, and, you know, it really makes you hurt inside, and, you know, like, it's gonna be okay. So, this was the reasons why I fell for Chris. Any follow-up videos uh, will be posted on my channel. I will be posting um, my personal videos. I don't think I'm going to stick to this topic. This topic just happened to, you know, like, go big um, on Jada's channel, and I just wanted to explain myself. Oh, wow. That was it, guys. Um... So, you guys already know based on the tea that I know, you know, privately, and that I have posted on my Snapchat like a couple days ago. You guys already know that um, I personally think that they will eventually come back together because at the end of the day, y'all see what they have built together. I mean, if I was queen, I would have not, like, I would have, she already has a personal channel. She can, like, make it go bigger and bigger. And now more people will be supporting her. Why? Because they will see what she went through or, you know, what she's going through. Like, leaving her marriage and, you know, becoming a single mother and, do, and all those stuff. People will be supporting her because they will understand that she didn't just stay with him because they make mad money on YouTube and all those stuff. So I personally would do that. But then again, if they get back together, y'all gotta understand, a marriage is not a, like, boyfriend and girlfriend relationship. Like, you just have to go through divorce and divorce and cheat. Like, I can tell y'all that because, you know, I have, I know friends that their parents have gotten divorced before so they have explained to me how that whole divorce situation goes on you have to hire lawyers and all those extra stuff like and they are so young like going through all this right now like i'm sure she doesn't want to go through it now but then again think about it at this age he's already treating her like that and best believe guys it's not the first time that he cheats on her and we all know that okay it's not the first time he does that to her and i really love queen like queen is a really like when you look at her through her videos and whenever like you send her messages on social media she sometimes answer you and she's really nice like she interact with people that you know follow her and she also um has a nice soul just the way she talks about god and all the stuff but then i feel like the fact that chris i don't want to judge his faith like i mentioned before like on the other video if you haven't watched it make sure you watch that video i probably answered the little card up here so you can check that video out um I'm not gonna question his faith, but then I feel like whenever he talks about God, he's not really with the true, honest feeling, you know? He's probably saying that because he mentioned before that Queen was into church when he met her. So, probably the fact that she's into church is the reason why he also wanna talk about God and, you know, all those stuff. I'm really, really, really disappointed by Chris, but then again, 
like I said earlier, who am I to judge, not God. And we all make mistakes, but if you keep repeating the same mistake and keep apologizing for the same mistakes, then you are really, truly not sorry. Like, that's just me. I'm, I'm just straight up like that. I mean, like I said before, I'm nobody to judge. So basically, you guys just let me know what you guys think about the topic. And let's talk more. Let's interact with each other and let's, you know, see what you guys think that's my part my 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 side of the story that's what i personally think and me putting myself on the situation that's what i feel i would have done if i was queen now let's talk about me being the other girl that was involved in the cheating um i don't find her dumb because like i said chris is the full package you know like he got his stuff together he has a successful youtube channel actually like two because he has one with his son already even though he told the girl that they, he's planning on doing one with his son he already does have one with his son and i mean he's doing good on youtube i feel like she felt like instead of being chris and queen it would probably be like chris and elena channel you know popping youtube couples so i understand her at the end of the day but then again don't be so quick to you know spread your legs i mean let's just be real like you don't go like that especially you know i'm gonna give you guys advice here on youtube because i know the mo like the audience here on youtube are between like they're pretty young like between like literally 8 to 21 like that's the people that really be watching youtube I will tell you guys something, like don't meet a guy and sleep with him, I don't care about like that quick, I don't care about how good of a guy he may seem, like some people do sleep with the guy the first night and end up like be with that guy forever, but those cases are really hard, are really hard to find and really, you know, hard to see, don't be the type to just go ahead and oop, I guess he's cute, he took me out to eat, he, he told everybody, including the Uber drivers and the witches, that, oh, that's my wife, so let me just spray my legs open and give it to him, because he's living. Like, you spraying your legs open would not, you know, stop him from going to wherever he's from and, you know, talk to more girls. I mean, and plus, I personally do not like to talk to, like, take stuff seriously with people I like meet at the club. That's just me. Like, that's just me. I just feel like... If I met you at the club, especially when you, the fact that he tried to take her and her sister home, if I met you at the club, you trying to talk to me at the club, and I see you trying to get at someone else, I don't care if it's my sister or a stranger, I'm going to put like a red flag on you because I know you just want to mess around. And that's basically my, my take from it. There's also a video that was posted by Jada where she apologized on behalf of her and her sisters because she's the oldest out of all of them. I might talk about it because that video is like less than a minute. I don't know if I may react to it or talk about it. But yeah, just you guys let me know what you guys want to know or see next. And don't forget to follow me once again on all my social media platforms. That's Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat. I'm very active on Snapchat. You guys can always snap me. And my Snapchat is public so everybody can literally send me, you know, questions and concerns. And I'll make sure I answer to you guys. And guess what, guys? We are almost at 2,000 subscribers. Like, this is crazy. This is amazing. Like, thank you guys so much. Let's make this happen, guys. The goal by the end of the year is to reach 10K. We are almost at 2,000. Like, we are almost there. If we can pass that goal, that would be perfect. But, um, yes, guys. Once again, if you have not subscribed to the channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And... Give me more ideas of what you guys would like me to talk next or, you know, put my two cents in. Because you already know this story is all over the internet, so it's literally everybody's business. And if y'all don't know, I was one of the first people to react to that, um, the video of Chris cheating on uh, Queen with Jada. And I have some tea about it. I'm just going to tell you guys some other time. I'll tell you guys how I was able to find it first, find out first. And yeah. So yes guys, thank you so much for watching this video once again. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, comment down below any type of topic you would like to see me next. And I'll keep repeating guys, subscribe, like what are you waiting for? You are watching me for like how long now? Like 10 minutes, 15 minutes? I don't know because I can't really see. But yeah, you have been watching me for a while so why don't you subscribe? Come on now, subscribe to your girl because you already know I'll be spilling all the tea. Okay? Okay. Alright guys, I'll catch you guys on my next video. Bye!